Hey YouTube, hey Facebook, this is episode 2 of, um, my series, Toxic Gamers. So today I got a ma uh, one of my game informers, and pretty much, um, I was reading it. And the information has come about that Fallout 76 will be getting a complete chain swap over. It means the game will be completely different from what it was. Again, this is because too many people bashed the game when it didn't need to be bashed. Again, proving once again that people, all people seem to want to do is join the bash wagon. This is what makes the gaming community so fucking toxic. Because, you know, hell, I enjoy Fallout 76. And there's, there's, there's a reason for multiplayer games and there's a reason for single player games. Granted, the new Fallout 76 will be a single player game. Granted, it does sound like it'll be pretty cool. And I'll probably enjoy it just as much. But the problem is, is the fact that people keep bashing a company even when they make good stuff. The game is, what, running an engine that was never built for online play in the first place, and yet it was working better than some of the other older engines that are running online play. Look at fucking GTA. GTA Online. You have to wait, ha like, I can't even count how many times I've gone into GTA, and it's turn and says, oh, we can't connect to Rockstar. Um, on good internet, bad internet, doesn't matter what kind of internet. I can't tell you how many times that shit's happened. But again, proves the point that toxic gamers are the reason why good games change. Or why good games no longer do well. Um, and guys, I, I, you know, it just it goes to say that we need to stop, like, the people who make gaming toxic. Like I uh, put earlier, Dare to Game uh, was my other episode. It was about Dare to Game. Um... People like him who make the gaming community toxic and just feed into that negativity and that uh, toxic gaming community. And it makes it so other people don't even want to try the games. And then all of a sudden, now the game and the servers are running nice. Um, but now it's getting, getting a complete overhaul because of the toxic community. Again, guys, I'm tired of hearing the toxic gamers. Okay. But... I will keep doing this uh, series on toxic gamers until there isn't any more toxic gamers. Again, guys, don't forget to push that like and subscribe button and check out my other videos as well. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Have a great day.